The United States and its NATO allies are increasing hostility towards Russia with unscheduled military exercises in the Black Sea. Unreasonable accusations about Russia's plans to invade Ukraine are also part of a provocation that ends dangerous tensions. Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov condemned the aggressive act as a threat to national and international security. He warned that as a result of hostilities, the Russian Federation could take an asymmetrical response. We will act reciprocally, and if necessary, also asymmetrically, Lavrov said, referring to a spike in NATO drills near Russia's borders. First of all, it must be said that the behavior of the US and its NATO is completely broken. The unprecedented increase in warships and reconnaissance aircraft near Russia's borders amounted to aggression. According to international law it is a criminal act. Even more dire, the unscheduled NATO exercise is an investigation into Russia's defense systems coupled with the threat of offensive operations by the Kiev regime against the Russian people in southeastern Ukraine and against Russian territory. The buildup of NATO increases the risk of all-out conflict. Therefore, in these circumstances, Russia reserves the right to respond on the basis of self-defense from existing threats to its national security. A reciprocal response would be to fire warning shots at NATO aircraft or ships in the same manner as when the British destroyer HMS Defender approached Russian territorial waters in June. Another reciprocal action is that Russia conducts naval and air exercises off the U.S. coast. America's predictable apoplectic reflexes in that scenario would illustrate the ranking hypocrisy and double thinking of what they're doing now in the Black Sea on Russia's doorstep. U.S.-based political analyst Randy Martin says Russia has quite a few aces. He pointed to Russia's strong position as a supplier of space technology to the United States. This new frontier to coveted superpower status could embarrass the United States if Russia withholds exports of space technology. If Russia is to turn these global markets to its advantage, as it should, then the impact of a faltering Western economy will be severe. Already, soaring consumer price inflation in the US and Europe has fueled social and political discontent. If prices at the pump or household energy bills rise further, Western governments will be more worried about their rest of populations than flying surveillance drones over Ukraine and the Black Sea. There are other options available to Russia to respond to US and NATO provocations. Moscow can restrict airspace over Russia to Western commercial flights crossing Asia and the Pacific and vice versa. The extra fuel costs for longer flights will be painful for an industry already in deep financial trouble.